So yeah, there's certain kinds of information that uh, bad guys are going to ask for that you should never share. And I don't care whether it's on the phone, over the web, wherever. One, social security number. Your social security number was never intended to be a unique identifier in the first place. But companies have adopted it. Credit agencies all use it. But there is a way to say, no, I'm not comfortable giving you my entire social security number. I will give you the last four. In most cases, that's sufficient. Uh, in some cases, you have to give them the full social security number, but I recommend you only do that on a written application that you hand to an individual in the place of business that you are uh, seeking credit from. So that's one. Next would be your address and phone number. Because by giving your address and phone number, sometimes it's public information, they can find it if they need it. Um, a third is your email address that you use for private uh, communication. I have probably eight to ten email addresses myself. One I use for nothing but personal communication. Several others I use when I need to sign up for a service or get a discount on something because I know it's going to get junk mail in it the day after I sign up. And others I use for purposes where I really want to maintain a certain level of privacy and I keep those very distinct and separate from my others. 